I'm Monica Friedman, pediatric rheumatologist at Orlando Health Arnold Palmer Hospital for Children. Some of you may not know this, but July is Juvenile Arthritis Awareness Month, and juvenile idiopathic arthritis, or JIA as physicians will shorten it to, um, is actually a very common disease. One in 1,000 children have this. Juvenile idiopathic arthritis is a chronic arthritis seen in patients who are less than 16 years of age. Uh, when we talk about chronicity, that's uh, at least six weeks of arthritis, which is uh, a combination of joint swelling, joint fluid, um, excess joint fluid, um, warmth and limitation in motion. And pain does fall into the category of arthritis, but it's uh, typically a separate entity for most patients. Yes, parents can support their children in both physical and emotional ways. Um, physical therapy and physical activity are very important to patients with arthritis. Getting them set up in school with a 504 plan, which helps to set up accommodations for them if they have any difficulties with climbing stairs or they have any difficulties walking long distances from class. Um, or if they need extra time to take tests. And emotional support is very important too. Anytime a patient has a chronic disease, it's very stressful on them. So working on good mental health and being that emotional support for them is super important.